Greetings ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rama from the Snap and today we're playing the strongest deck in Marvel Snap, the tier 0 meta threat, the end of Marvel Snap, we're playing Thanos Blob. And I even cut Leech so you guys get a very enjoyable video today, but I think you're wondering, Ramek, what's the win rate? How good is this deck? I think, does this win rate show you right now on screen? 30 games? where we had a 73% win rate and 42 cubes obtained. Yeah, this deck is absolutely disgusting. We have just not been able to lose. We didn't lose once. All we did was retreat. We never lost the game. That is how broken this deck is. 100% win rate, basically, if we don't count retreating as losing. And why is that? Because the deck does everything. Thanos gives you so much just raw potential in just doing absolute bulls. Like, everything's stupid. It's absolutely dumb what this deck can do. Mindstone in the opening hand is probably a snap-worthy moment on itself. Logjaw can just allow you to instantly win games you should have been losing by dropping a gi giant guy like Magneto and just locking someone's lane. It's so ridiculously powerful. Kaera protects all of your stones, all of your six costs, so they can't even interact unless they just rogue that and Shang-Chi something, which requires them to also play Zabu. Wave is ridiculous. She lets you ramp into stuff early, just don't ramp into the blob, you need your other stuff. Vision lets you access unreachable locations. She-Hulk is just so good, as you can time stone on five, pass turn, play She-Hulk into another lane, and blob another to just sneak in another W and you even have stuff like Scar to just even get to play a lot it's just so strong it has even Shang-Chi to destroy other people's stuff Jeff so you can just access again hard to reach locations and Psylocke to ramp you can replace Psylocke with Leech but I wouldn't do it I mean Leech is the most broken part of the deck and it is very much worth running. I just really don't like running Leech in decks. So I run the Psylocke instead to give us some more ramp potential. And I think you guys want to see how the deck performs. So without further ado, boys, make sure to give the video a quick like, comment, and subscribe. As it helps me a lot. I do these every day. And without further ado, boys, let's get snapping. Okay, guys, we're just playing the most broken deck in the game. So I gave it no title, no anything. And we're just gonna, well, see what we can do. Can we get the Thanos maybe infinite sweep? Can we just win every single game? We'll see right now. And we're up against by Tesla stocks. We are shuffling the rocks into the deck. We're gonna give a fist bump to the boy. Hello, hello. Where everyone's gonna say hello. We drew the soul stone. We have way, we have soul stone. Oh my god, this hand is busted. This is busted. I won't play anything as we're so ahead already. I just see the wave, I see the lock, John. I know how good we are. Uh, I don't know. Do I even complain about the meta right now? I don't know. I really hate the Thanos meta, but I guess I'm playing the deck today so I don't get to complain. Is that what I'm supposed to say? I don't know. I still hate it. I don't like this. I don't like that this uh, deck is good. We're up against the Black Knight, so this will be interesting. Oh dear, I just rolled the world ship. How about that? Uh, I bluff a blob, I guess. Okay. Can I draw the blob? No. Can I get to it though? It's all up to destiny now. She Hulk. Okay. Black Cat, it's Hella. I didn't draw it. I didn't draw the blob. If I did, I would have won. Oh my god. They, if they have Ghost Rider, we're dead. Otherwise, we're pretty much clean. Maybe. Maybe. Ghost Rider and Black Cat is even odds, so we don't lose. Yeah. Okay, sometimes you gotta go on balls. There we go, we won another cube. How many cubes can you win, Romic? I don't know, we'll see what we can do. Can we get up to rank 69? Rank 69, we can get up to 71. And guys, I have some news. Romic has been silenced from the Marvel Snap Discord. I've already seen some people, I, I've seen a guy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show up his name right now. What is his name? Uh, okay, give me a sec. My Discord actually doesn't let me. I cannot see it if I'm doing this. Gatsu from Berserk got banned because they thought I was him. 
Bro thinks he's him, like come on. Guys, first of all, I'd name myself Guts from Berserk, not Gatsu. What am I, a weeb? No no offense to you, Gatsu from Berserk. You're you're my you're a Giga Chad. You were preaching the Romic choir. I'm sorry you got banned. It's okay. I mean, the Marvel Snap Discord did ban me. I have nothing to say except it's what happens. I, I, I have nothing further to add. We had fun. We were talking about stuff. Everyone said, Romic, you're kind of a dick. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what did you think? Like, I have to... I only treat my fans well. Otherwise, I don't know. I'm just kidding. I treat everyone terribly. But hey, we have Wave, we have Scar, we have Magneto. Things are looking, I don't know, pretty clean. Otherwise, you people ask me, like, Romy, how do you feel now that you cannot talk anymore in the Marvel Snap Discord? I don't know, like, I can troll all I want, but it was fun while it lasted. We did we did talk a ton, we talked about Yu-Gi-Oh!, we talked about a possible future limited list for Marvel Snap. I did everything I wanted to, basically, there. It was fun, it was a fun discussion failed a couple of nights, even though a lot of people got unreasonably upset for some reason. I don't know, when I ever said a card was, like, terrible. I mean, the mod... Yo! There's the angel! Oh my god, that is sick! Well... Uh, Magneto doesn't do anything. But I better play him anyway. Nothing else to add. Is he gonna null? Let's hope he does. Uh, currently, I don't know if we're in a good position to win. We didn't draw any of the broken stuff. We're just playing Wave Turbo. Bucky Barnes. It's not an AI. AIs don't exist in Infinite, so... What is there to... D do? What do we have in deck? A lot of good hits. I mean... I mean, I better do this. I won't snap. Venom could be kind of disastrous. Well, we got Shang. That's pretty good. That's a hit we're not gonna get. The literal worst card to hit in the entire deck. Wolverine jumps right. Bucky Barnes get, gets himself on right as well. Uh, that Soulstone was actually the single worst hit in the game. Funnily enough, it might not matter. I mean, I mean, we just do this, we kind of win. It's not guaranteed, but the chances to win are... Wait, I'm supposed to Power Stone them Blob if I want to do this. The worst thing we can get is a Time Stone. Yeah. Yeah, Time Stone is the worst thing we can get. Hopefully I did it in the right order, because otherwise... Ugh. Death is pretty bad, but like Null is fine. Yeah, Null is fine. We can deal with Null. We cannot deal with Death. We're losing priority, which is quite good. The Kayera would be a good one. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't protect us. Shang. We win. Turns out the game did not matter at all. We have beaten... Well, whatever this is, Jeff, oh my god, my- and this is, guys, why I don't play broken decks. Because we never have good luck with them. Look, a 630. Just a 630. This deck is stupid juice. It's so broken, I cannot believe this. Like, this deck is so stupid. I can get to rank 1 with this. I legit think I can get to rank 1. This isn't even just having a- No! I mean, KM second best, the joke is there, but no! All I want is to get rank 69, to put it in the Discord chat, and there we go. I get to brag, hey KM, I'm rank 69 now, and then he's gonna say, Romic, I'm higher rank than you. Shut up! It doesn't matter, who cares? I'm rank 69, it's the funny number, okay? Everyone's supposed to laugh at it, right? I, what is a KM, be a KM best rank anyway? He's the 12th guy in America. Ooh, I'm gonna get to him in points. Up against Poggy Bonsi, he's playing the, well, best deck in the game, as we are, so... Titan is the feature location which he heavily powers us up. Cannot forget that little part. We have Jeff. If he snaps, I'm getting out, since Mind Stone or Lockjaw is too strong. Reality Stone tells me that he might have a bad hand. Oh my god. 
Is that a snap-worthy moment? The Bifrost. I'm definitely gonna time stone. I should. Like, he's on the back foot. I play Vision there. And I get one more energy. Like, this is interesting, if anything. Now the game is actually quite interesting. If they retreat, it's fine. But we don't have access to the Blob or the Lockjaw line, so it's quite a bit harder. Okay, we did manage to bait out our retreat. We didn't have almost any gas in our hands, so... I mean, we're gonna see what we can do. We currently have... Uh, too high of a win rate. We're, we're just not dropping any games. I'm doing this video because a lot of you wanted actually to see Thanos for some reason. I have no idea why. I said it was the most broken deck in the game and the only thing worth playing and you're like, I'm like, but why? Why is this deck so broken? And I think that this video will be perfect to show it off. This deck just cannot lose. It cannot lose. Does it climb as fast as a lot of other things? No, but it's so brutally overpowered there is nothing that even remotely beats it it's that sad like it okay at least we got the nerd thanos who starts in your hand okay we'll play power stone left and we're up against another thanos player uh, get prepared to see this a lot more often as well i hope the ota hurts the deck a ton since for now thanos is so unbeatably strong i don't know what we can do do i ramp next turn probably we have Power Stone, we have Jeff. We don't have any of our unfair stuff, so we're at quite a bit of a disadvantage. Titan is powerful. I mean, it's powerful, but it's also not that good. We get to play a 6 cost anyway next turn. I mean, it's pretty good. Blob is a really good one. So we're both at plus 5 energy. Uh, I cannot forget that this might just be... I get to play a 6 cost and a 6 cost. Uh, I'll play Magneto into Thanos mid. This allows me to play Scar for basically free and then Blob anything out. I can also Shang next turn into blo uh, like Blob. Go, go Magneto, go. Scar becomes one energy. I might just Shang on Curve, it's not that bad. Vision, Professor X. Mindstone. He has a lot more card advantage than we do. As, as like Yagami has said, sometimes you can't do things alone, sometimes you must attack! And I think now it's the time to attack. Oh my god, well that worked perfectly. <whistles> Shang-Chi takes out the vision and the entire problem we have had. A Scar just getting played on Titan. Lockjaw into Shang? Time Stone. Well, well, well. Look what we have here. I think we can snap. He has 7 energy, but I don't think it's enough. Oh my god, that draw absolutely kills him. My god, this deck is unbeatable! It's unbeatable! This video will be shorter, because what do I have to add? What insightful commentary can I say? Yeah, the deck is broken as shit. What did you think I was gonna say? You know what, guys? The deck is secretly balanced. It is actually quite skill expressive, and it actually requires a lot of brain power. No, it's broken. It's dumb. This is so broken and it is one of the worst things to see. I'm not even running Leech. I have decided to cut Leech. I don't need him. I don't need the Leech. I just play without Leech. Why would I? I just have enough power. I can do whatever. And people are thinking Leech might be the problem. No, it's not Leech. It's a lot of other things. And why, Romic, why are you not using the Reality Stone? Boom. You just find out why. I can't just use Reality Stone willy-nilly. If we're playing against, I don't know what can this be, might be Ramp. At the end of the day, this might be something completely different. We can't just do stupid stuff. We need to just play perfectly and we might never lose. Magic? Kayera, actually. Ramp Blob, perhaps. If it's Ramp Blob, it's a Ramp Blob fight he's gonna get. I'll play Thanos into Titan, which is quite fitting. He is a Titan. I get to play him. 
He didn't get the ramp portion. If he snaps, I'm actually gonna get out. We do have Blob, but we don't have a lot of other things. We, If I had Kayera, I would have stayed in. Hi, Evo. Exactly what I was aiming for. That's when we reality stoned. Hmm. So if... No, 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 no. I think we actually lose. As if they leech us, we can't blob. Or shang. Or do anything. Plus, they might also play tech. And tech is quite bad. They can also sit their ass on Sunspot. We didn't get any unfair stuff like Kayera. If I got Kayera, I would stay. I can swap Limbo out. But then I don't get to play the blob. Yeah, we're retreating here. Why would we stay? We don't need to. We dictate the game. That's the problem with him. And this is how you beat High Evil, ladies and gentlemen. I just wanted to point it out because I noticed a lot of people actually have difficulty. We got to rank 69. We did it! I can end the video right here. We did it. Rank 69! It has been obtained now, from now on and forever. KM best. I am rank 69 until I win another game, which will happen in a few minutes. So until then, I am rank 69. Up against Molinator, one of the best players in the world. Let's see what we can do. We have Lockjaw, we have Scar, we have Kayera. This hand is looking actually not so great. Especially if we're in a mirror and they open Mindstone. Whoever opens Mindstone usually just instantly wins the game. So let's hope they did not open the Mindstone. If they're waiting this long, they probably have Mindstone. They're just thinking of snapping. Space Stone, actually. Seeing a Thanos not play anything on one makes me always try to snap. Rickety Bridge. We have Kayeta for that. Space Stone as well. We just get to draw a card. I'm fine with just Kayera into Lockjaw. And then if we draw a stone, we're good. And in Rickety Bridge, anyone can sleep. Just like, sleep right tight. Man. Hmm. Okay, we got the blob. If I can guarantee a win on the kiln, we just win. Well, that Kayera is the best thing we could have gotten. Just sleep now in the Noir Dimension, just Lockjaw into a Jin, and we can maybe win. Because we can just pass for a lot. I mean, a problem is now we're just drawing a lot of the stuff Blob is supposed to be good in, so... Like, we drew She-Hulk, we drew Scar, we drew Thanos, we drew... 31 of the Blob's power, which is quite bad, but there's still... 20... 25... 28, 31, 33 power in the deck, not even counting the 5 Infinity Stones I did not draw. So, is our opponent willing enough to snap? No, they're respecting it. Maybe they're playing the Lockdown portion. Oh, well, there it is. The best card in the game, Mind Stone, gets resolved. The Jin is very powerful. Are they gonna try to lock mid out? I have a sneaking suspicion this won't work too well. Because we have five infinity stones and two good hits. I mean, I'd even take a reality stone at this point. I, at least I get to still keep playing into the kiln. But there is a funny thing that can now happen. I can play the djinn. We will get the energy. I then pass turn. And just play... I mean, but if we lose the kiln, that's just really bad. We cannot win if we just don't win the kiln. Shang is now not a thing they worry about. 7 energy. 7 energy. Magneto. A bit... That is even more power shaved off the blob. I'll pass. Man, Jeff would really unlock us. I'm passing because there is not much we can do. I'm kind of screwed. We drew to everything huge and not of our good combos. 
Well, I mean, sometimes them's the breaks. You really just can't win them all. Especially in a mirror against a really good player. Their positioning is immaculate. That Power Stone mid is more of a problem than anything. If, if they have Kayera, it never dies. But that me requires me to win Noir Dimension, and if they don't have Kayera, it's fine. Yeah, we're getting out. They can, like, just because they won the kill, now they always win if they just blob. Because I'm forced to play mid. Yeah, I mean, Thanos mirrors are like that. What can you say? Thanos mirrors are some of the most boring games of Marvel Snap. I mean, we'll play one more. Just give us one more. I'll make fine. I'll deliver even one more. Can this one be against something that's not Thanos blob? As I'm just really tired of the mirrors. And you guys can see my win rate. Like, you saw it in the beginning of the video. This deck is nuts. It's nuts. It's so nuts I didn't even name it. I was just like, okay, I'm gonna put up like the best Thanos list I can find that doesn't require the stupid idiot known as Leech, and I'm just gonna pop off. And what happened? We didn't lose. Well, like, we just couldn't lose. It was that strong. I think we just pass. Don't be Mind Stone, please. Space Stone. A mistake. You don't open Space Stone unless you are really bricked. Pet Mansion. Wait a turn. Wait a minute. We'll just see what's the third location, and then we'll pop off. We Psylocke here. Limbo. Can be interesting. We drew Scar. Not the best draw. We lock Giant to Mind Stone. The chances we roll Soulstone are so low, we might win. What is this? Oh, we lose. I hit the 1 in 15. How much is that? Oh my god, we hit the 1 in 13 chance to instantly lose. I mean, this is the Romic type of video. Like, Romic would just get the blob into immediate despair. Yeah, I mean, we opened well, but that's why you don't snap. You just wait for your first lockjaw and then you pop off. Oh my god. Oh man. I mean, we didn't lose so far, but we're just retreating like men because damn it all. That was so bad. I mean, what did I expect? I am playing the best deck in the game. The luck won't affect us up against Komis. Is he playing the Black Knight or has he joined the 12 cards in deck? Nine cards in deck. They're not playing the Thanos. Oh my god. Titan getting hit. I'll see. I'll play Power Stone on two in just in case. Commoditage. Ooh. Rough draw. Yeah, the draws so far are ass. Up against Living Tribunal. Maybe. Maybe it's just regular stuff. I mean, Psylocke is really good. I'll Kayeta anyway. The Psylocke allows me to play a 6 cost next turn, but why? where am I rushing to? I'll wait, fine, I'll wait. Maybe it's goblin mode, I don't know. If it's goblin mode... Huh? Okay then. Living Tribunal, it is, so... We'll Psylocke into Mind Stone and then Magneto it all away. All we need is Reality Stone. The Psylocke survived! Thanks, Reality Stone. Iron Lad becoming Miss Marvel. The Scar gets to be played for free. Since we're currently losing priority, I get to do that little yoinky sploinky I like doing so much. Okay. Zabu into magic. Jubilee. Well, it is. It did happen, just not in the way I prescribed. Scar mid. And space stone right. They have another copy of Marvel. Can't forget that. Okay.
This way we take care of most of our issues. Plus it gets to move marble and that's pretty strong. Marvel, as I predicted. Wave. All we need now is to just move enough. Check, please. Four cubes for us. Easy enough. For the final game, we really did dispatch the Living Tribunal as a god would. That was an absolute deliverance. I have seen this deck so much. I tried to play it, but you can't play it right now, guys. I don't think it's that good. The Living Tribunal folds to Magneto. Ah! We lost rank 69. Okay, let's go back to deck edit. Wow, it's broken. Who knew? I was. It was so broken that I didn't even decide to give it a name. Yeah, that's how broken this deck is. If you want the easiest way to get to infinite, just run this deck and there you go. You always win. It's so broken. What do I even say? How did they nerf it? I have no idea. Dropping the blob to a 6-0, I think, does nothing. He is broken. I think the way they will nerf him is in a giant patch. The blob will become merge your deck into this and gain... And it, its power becomes their cost. Like, they're just all gonna combine their cost instead of their power. That's it. That's what I think they'll do. And that is probably the only way to balance blob and not make it just like a 6-58... Which is what it currently is, and it's really stupid. The fact this deck can just play into one lane and blob another to instantly win is absolutely terrifying. It runs Lockjaw, so you can just win games off of some sack machines. You also have stuff like Leech, but I'm not playing Leech as I'm based like that. And well, boys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a quick like, comment, and subscribe, as I do these every day. And until further, boys, I was Romic, and I'll see you in the Snap Mania. Take care, all of you.